What's going on, everyone? Welcome to this short message from St Stand Fast <clears throat> Community Baptist Church. Uh, I just want to touch bases with you guys a little bit um, and just be uh, transparent on a, on a few things. Uh, nothing bad, nothing bad at all. Um, I know I haven't been as consistent uh, over the last, say, maybe month and a half to two months uh, as I would like to be as far as uh, doing new broadcasts, as far as the Wednesday study and the, and the Sunday sermon. Uh, but just know that we're still on track and that um, everything is good and I should be back on a regular schedule uh, from uh, going forward. And again, to be transparent, uh, I, I've actually been blessed. God has really been blessing me. Uh, today, uh, I started a new job. And so uh, when I got home and after I ate, I was a little tired. I ended up falling asleep um, and then waking up at the last minute. So um, I'll get that taken care of. But just getting back, because uh, I've been off of work for a few months now. Uh, my last job that I worked, I didn't get fired or anything like that, but it was a temp job. It was at uh, UC Davis Health. So I was making really good money and everything. And then uh, my assignment ran out. I was hoping to get on to be getting on permanent, uh, but it just I missed it by this much. Uh, but it was God's will, so I'm good. Started a new job today. Everything looks good. It feels great. So now I can get back uh, on track um, and kind of get uh, my finances together and all that. Which uh, my finances really it bleeds over to the ministry because uh, a lot of the, the the money that I use or most of the money that I use. Uh, this from my own pocket, so I, you know, if I'm getting tight on bills here and there, uh, it's going to reflect a little bit in the ministry. And thank you to those that that uh, do pay like the tithes and offering. It does help uh, and goes into the ministry and uh, getting things taken care of here. So uh, things are good. I just want to say that things are good. Uh, again, I'm blessed, um, and I'm just going to be more consistent from here on out. I found another program. Uh, that will help me to get our Wednesday study and the uh, Sunday service on YouTube and Facebook. Because those of you who remember, uh, the reason why it's been a little wonky lately is because the last program that I used, they raised, they doubled the price basically on me. It was going to be like uh, something like fifty bucks a month or something like that, just for this one little program. Uh, and I was like, I'm not going to pay that. So. Uh, anyways, I found another one that has about the same price or maybe a little bit cheaper than the original price of the first one that I was. And, and just to be a little clear, the programs that I use, uh, it enables me to record and do everything I need to do, like do the graphics and stuff like that, put the logo up, do all that. And then I can assign it to where I want it to broadcast. So it, it'll say like, where do you want to broadcast this? Where, where do you want it to go? I, I hit uh, YouTube. I hit Facebook, and then I think sometimes I'll do Twitter, and I have like another another place or whatever. So it makes it so much easier because it's a one-stop shop. So I don't have to log on to, to Facebook and do all this, that, and the other, and then log on YouTube and do all this, that, and the other. And so this program helps me to uh, just do all that real quick. Uh, it, it puts up the little uh, message saying that, you know, coming up at 10 o'clock, this message, or... Uh, the Wednesday Bible study is coming up in a few hours, the notices or whatever. So it does that for you as well. Um, you can put your thumbnail in it. So it, it makes it so much easier. So just uh, want to just touch bases with you guys since there was no message tonight. Uh, and just say that God is, is still blessing us. Uh, blessing stand fast. So don't, I don't want anyone to get think that we're losing steam uh, over here because we're not. Actually, we're getting ready to grow. Uh, I'm going to start uh, doing more stuff with our children's ministry. Uh, we have uh, different children that are spread out uh, amongst uh, all of you out there. So I'm um, going to start a, a children's ministry where uh, I start teaching the young young ones uh, about the Bible and put it in, in a way that they can understand. And I'll figure some stuff out. I'm still coming up with ideas. If you guys have any ideas. So what I plan on doing is meeting maybe once a month, twice a month. And then doing stuff where we do a Bible study, but then have some kind of activity for the kids so they're not just sitting there the whole time. So uh, it may be at a park or maybe at someone's house. It depends on how big it gets. So there's different things that we're uh, still working on. So just want to say uh, everything is good. Again, uh, this is also a praise report 
because I've been praying for uh, a good job that I would, would be able to do. Um, and I think I found one uh, that God blessed me with. So uh, I'm excited about that. Like I said, I just ran out of gas today because uh, I hadn't had to get up this early or early as I did this morning in a while. So I've been kind of sleeping in a little bit, if you, if you know what I mean. So, uh, but everything is good. I got to be work tomorrow at 7.30. We'll say 7 o'clock and it's way in the south there. And so I have to get up a little bit earlier or whatever. But uh, I'm blessed. Um, I'm not going to say we're back because we've never been anywhere. But I just want to at least touch bases with you guys and let you know that we're still rocking and rolling. Uh, just And then also, too, keep in mind that uh, it's just me as far as bringing the word and teaching. A lot of the churches that we were used to, they have several ministers on staff, so if one person uh, can't make it or, or teach, uh, they'll have the uh, associate pastor or one of the reverends preach, so they have that luxury. Uh, with we'll stand fast, it's a blessing because uh, we don't have to answer to anyone as far as our vision, uh, but sometimes if something comes up, if I'm sick or sometimes if I'm away from uh, the house, which is the studio, this is where I record everything in here, studio slash church. Uh, uh, facility, um, then it's hard for me to, to get to where I can put a new uh, broadcast out or message. So, but anyways, things are good. Just wanted to touch bases with you guys. I hope you guys are blessed. Uh, feel free to reach out. My phone, for those of you that don't know, has been off. Uh, my main number, the 4105058. But I do have an alternate phone that I've been using, uh, and it's 916 613. 5411 916-613-5411. So my regular phone, my main line will be back on, uh, Lord willing, within a week or two or something like that. I'm doing a little maintenance on it, if you will. Uh, but anyways, you guys, I uh, hope you're blessed. If you have any questions, uh, reach out to me. Um, again, if you have any ideas that you think might be a good idea for us uh, to do as far as like working with kids, um, any ideas as, as far as activities, uh, things like that, let me know. And uh, we're going to try to do a lot of eating. And not that we need to entertain people to hear the gospel, but it just builds uh, a relationship when we hang out more and, and do things together. Kids that may not normally uh, get a chance to interact with each other will be able to do so at church like when we were growing up. So again, I just want to reiterate that we're not looking for entertainment in order to get people to sit down and listen to the gospel. Either they're going to do it or they're not. I mean, we're not called to entertain people. But again, it's good fellowship after we hear, hear the word. Uh, it's good fellowship to hang out with each other, uh, strengthen and encourage each other. So anyways, I'm going to let you guys get. You guys have a blessed night, blessed week. We'll see you this Sunday morning at 10 a.m., Lord willing. God bless.